All right, one second later, and I actually just opened a one of those mystery things, and it gave me a block of diamond. Wait, burn time? What is that? A million? A million ticks? What does that mean? Oh, to co wait, I'm I'm actually interested here. Nothing else has burn time here, right? That's how long it takes to do what? <laughs> oh, for fuel. Oh. Okay, that's interesting. So 5,000 items for a block of diamond. I mean, I guess that's fair. Like, that's a lot of items, but that's also a block of diamond. <laughs> no, that, I, I feel like you wouldn't use, you're like, you would, should never use a block of diamond on that, but you know. I guess it could come up. <laughs> All right, so hopefully this water tank siding just works as, you know, I would hope it would work. Oh, I need to, <laughs> I need to build like a, a staircase, you know, a stairway to heaven over here. All right, last one. Boom. Okay, it's working. It's working. <laughs> uh, I can't tell if it's working, but, uh, you know, it's, it's fine. Yeah, it's kind of really impossible. Oh, okay, let's see. So the water is currently actually going up. If you can tell in the bottom right corner, at least it's going up to in my in my books. It's barely going up though. It's like mm, like one or two every second or something like that. That's it's good enough though. Like that'll probably uh at least ease my burdens of having to carelessly craft cactuses. I'm sure there's a way I can automate the cactus farm a little bit more than just how it is, but I, I don't have a way to auto craft yet, I don't think. Um, but yeah, this, this this should work fine. All right. Um, yeah, so now we just make the assembly machine. All right, so I got most of the crafting done for uh, <laughs> this one little part here. I think we're just waiting on, what are we waiting on? <laughs> Um, let me just make sure we're not wasting steam. Turn it off real quick. And then, so yeah, we are, let me go to sleep as well. And you can see my crates back there. <laughs> I have three stacks of potatoes. <gasps> Excuse me. Uh, okay. So we were making the last vacuum tube. And what is the last vacuum tube for? You might ask. It is for this last electronic circuit. And we can move on to my final crafting table where we just need the machine hole, which I think, what are you, what are we, I wish it showed you what I was making with it. Um, here, let me, let me turn this thing back on or like what was in progress. Cause right, right now you don't know what's in progress just based off of, um, you know, you just see a loading bar, right? It was steel, but uh, <laughs> sometimes I wish uh, it would show you. But anyways, okay, so we are making the LV machine hole, which we need the casing for, which we should have everything we need here. We just need a wrench, right? That's a wrench. Hello? Okay, there we go. <laughs> Hello, is this thing on? All right, then the machine hole, we should have that. Uh, we have those. One of these, one of those, some of these, some of those. All right, there we go. Machine hole done. Oh, ah, oop, ah, oop. All right, basic assembling machine. Hey, we got it. We assembled. Oh my God, what is this? Hey, quest complete. What do you mean quest complete? There was a quest. I mean, I I just noticed the fireworks. Isn't wasn't that cool? Let, let me go to the quest. Uh, unclaimed rewards. We get a loot bag. <laughs> okay, let's see. Leather and bread. What what a surprise. Just what the doctor ordered. <laughs> Which doctor, you might ask? I, I'm not sure, but it was a doctor. A theoretical doctor. <laughs> Alright, so what does this thing do? Recipes. There's 4,000 recipes. You can make a dirt chest. Which is obviously the top tier chest. Honestly, I should just make that now. <laughs> okay, so we just made the trash can. Um, <laughs> let's see what we get. I'm addicted. All right, a hammer. That's useful. What what level is it? I think it's. Let's see. 
<laughs> I was about to put the trash can down, but what's more important is this hammer durability. Okay, no, it's not. It's nothing compared to diamond hammer. <laughs> all right, so we can now just void all of our liquids, right? Is it is it working? It's working. Perfect. All right, so now we can automate our creosote creation. Um, I guess all we need to do is get a bunch of logs and then send the logs to the coke oven and then take the charcoal out of the coke oven and either put it into a chest and put that chest charcoal into um, the blast furnace and then that should I mean not necessarily speed up the process but like it'll make it easier I mean instead of I guess I could also just create more black blast furnaces um, to, you know and then more coke ovens uh, as you can see, I'm out of wood, so I, I probably should get wood before I, <laughs> before I do anything. And you might say, oh, wait, this creosote is actually useful for stuff. It, it is. It is. Um, not right now. I can always make some later. Um, but yeah, okay. Now I don't really know where to go from here. I guess I could, I'll just make the rest of the machines. I, I don't know. Basics. A centrifuge, probably. That's probably what they're going to make. Because uh, it makes um, get byproducts, right? So that, that just like increases everything that will increase in efficiency is what we need to do. And it looks like we need a centrifuge to get this glue thing. Um, I'm not sure why we need glue, but you know, and this is not the Tinker's glue. This is the Greg Tech glue. It's different. <laughs> I hate when mods do that. All right, I'm going to make a centrifuge. All right, we've all been there before when you <laughs> die, in, <laughs> die in the nether and uh, you lose everything over and over and over again, right? Here, or is that just me? Because it feels like it's just me. Oh no, I ran out of sand. <laughs> oh, <no>. Crap. Well, <laughs> oh, look how many times I died. <laughs> Crap. I don't know what these lava monsters are, and why is it the first time I'm seeing them? But uh, I, I think I got, I fell into the lava. I'll admit it now. <laughs> so here I am trying to get my stuff back. It's, it is a nightmare. All right, this one only took me about. 20 million deaths. Let me let me get a quick track. How many times I've died today? Ooh, yeah, that's a uh, that's at least two. So uh, there was there. It's kind of strange because there was skeletons spawning on my grave. I think it was because I died back to back, like in the same location. I think that this is that's this mod pack specifically. But it was kind of really annoying. Like I even got in a treadmill because I was like I I can't deal with this anymore. All right, set up some automation, makes my, my life easier. I have a simple, tiny 10 item pipe. Just going to one, uh, one of these coke ovens. Automatically feed it wood for my, my little stash here of wood. Um, this might last like a couple hours. I'm just burning in here. I, yeah, at least a couple hours. The thing burns pretty slowly. Um, but yeah, so what I, what I did, I just have these two, uh, I just have two of these uh, conveyor modules just made of rubber. And then I um, kind of just <laughs> attached it to the thing and it kind of worked. Um, I did have to fiddle with exporting and importing, but uh, it, it, it works. I mean, it just, it just works. <laughs> um, yeah. Anyway, so yeah, I, I think I want to set that up with this as well to export charcoal from here into here so that I don't have to feed it charcoal anymore. Um, yeah, I mean, that's, that's what I got to do, but I need to make more rubber to do that <laughs> because this thing requires a lot of rubber. So I guess I'm going to be cooking some rubber all night. All right. We are so back in our endless pursuits of mv power <laughs> so where am i at so we have the round and round actually let me show you the automation the auto i think this automation is pretty cool actually so we got we don't have automated logs yet we, don't, we can't make those quite yet i mean i guess we probably i know there's like tree growers that cut them down but we haven't gotten the chance to make them yet i i don't like in this minecraft version just right clicking the bed doesn't set your spawn i think in later Mon minecraft versions they do that anyway so we are automatically piping logs in here with uh, these item pipes and whatever this item is called, the conveyor module, conveyor belt. So 
I'm getting logs in here. The logs are automatically creating creosote. And the creosote is pumped into our trash can I showed earlier down below, our liquid trash can. And then we're taking the logs. Here, here's one, for example. It's just created. It takes a minute. I don't know why it takes a second to ship on over. But it's shipping on over to over here. This is interesting. Um, yeah, it's shipping on over to here. Our fire iron steel furnace. <laughs> That's the official name. <gasps> Sorry, brick blast furnace. I couldn't remember the name for some reason. Anyway, so I'm actually out of iron here, surprisingly. But uh, I, I don't have iron input automated because uh, I don't have that much iron. In fact, I just went mining for a bunch of copper. You can tell because my, my hammer is like half broken. It's actually kind of surprising. I mined a lot. I didn't mine the whole vein, but I, I bet if I did mine the whole vein, it would probably break. Maybe before I got... I mean, this is a lot of... This is like all copper. So this, this should last me a long time. I need to get iron now, though, next. But anyways, the charcoal comes in here. And the leftovers, we're not outputting the steel. I tried to output the steel into here, but um, I guess I didn't. Let me show you. So we have export allow input, but it was originally on import allow output. So we're importing it into the system, right? We're importing whatever this is, the dark ashes into the system. And it's not going to go into here because you can't put dark ashes into a Coke oven. So it'll automatically go into this oak drawers. And I, I tried to, I mean, before, I, like, there was only one drawer. Let me show you. So I can, oh, I can't even interact with them in here. Okay, that's awkward. So anyway, I, I put them all in one drawer, right? And then, but it still won't output the steel into this one. I'm not sure yet why, but I guess a solution to that, I could have another drawer probably and another conveyor module and just have it steal. Um, oh, that's a problem though. Look at that. I just put coal into here. Okay, so we don't want to do that. We want to have crap. Okay. Now I'm making a mess because I just came back from mining. <laughs> All right. Uh, we, we want to have, we don't want to put the coal in here. At least initially, because this, we only have one Crusoe maker here. Um, I decided this, this way of getting coal was way too slow and like manual because I have to, you know, put the wood blocks down. It, it does make a lot of coal, but it's, it's just too much brain power and me doing things. I want to not do things. That's what I want to do in this mod pack. I don't want to do anything. <laughs> oh man, we're having fun. We're having fun. But yeah, I guess next steps are to make this centrifuge so I can hopefully make this glue and, you know, get out of this low, low LV. I know there's a lot to do in this mod pack still or LV still. It's kind of crazy, but that's where I'm at.